Food and Trees for Africa is a PBO, an NGO that runs food security programs and urban greening. We've been running since 1990 and one of the main programs, our flagship program, is the Edgy Plant. Wooly started funding Edgy Plant program and partnering with Food and Trees for Africa since 2004. And right from the onset, we knew that this program will touch lives. We knew this program will make a huge difference. Food and Trees for Africa is immensely proud of the program. We run a cluster workshop that sees schools go through a two-year program before they enter the entry for the competition. Ever since we started going to the workshop, we've learned more knowledge on how to rebuild our garden. Because in 2014, our garden was a mess. But ever since we started going to workshop, we now have a greenhouse in our garden. Woolworths and the Eduplant program along with Food and Trees for Africa has accomplished over the last 14 years is tremendous and you can see it in the presentations and we can see it in the gardens. The plants that we're harvesting in our garden, we give to vulnerable learners and sell to the community. It forces children and educators, it forces farmers and gardeners to look forward into the future and see how their actions for today have those impacts. If we plant now, if we prepare our soil now, if we create our compost heaps now, we're going to eat in the future and we're going to eat well. Skills are imparted to learners, to educators, to communities to grow their own food, but not just in any other way in a way that's really conducive for the environment, in sync with the environment, and also quite cost efficient in a permaculture method. The Eduplant Finals sees so many schools come up and in that edutainment that happens over the four days sees children creating, recycling, crafts and artworks, what we call upcycling. We see them doing raw food um, workshops where they create salads and smoothies and learn about alternatives to sugar where they make incredible delicious food out of things that are hugely nutritious that they might not necessarily know they even enjoy. We also watch them learn about teaching permaculture creatively. This empowers the teachers in terms of teaching techniques and methods that makes their learning more fun and more engaging by using group work and various other teaching techniques. We also see the kids go through the garden and have have all their practical learnings unpacked where they do a whole lot of mulching and harvesting and planting where they get to practice everything that they've been talking about and share more stories in the garden and they do hiking and drumming and a whole lot of activities over the last four days. My favorite part of the camp was when we went for t-shirt printing because I do love printing and I'm creative. One of the things that the schools look forward to with the Eduplan program is the Eduplan Finals event, which is where we are today at Conquer. The kids that come and the learners that come to the finals event, I think they, their lives are changed forever. Because if being a permaculture, even give us air. 